Now, if we had some sort of backstory of what's going on, I'd still say, what the f- are you doing? Oh, yeah, because absolutely. out of all the shit you laid out, you're going to pick this? What are you doing? Pick <laughs> yeah. that shit or that shit right there. You know what I mean? Because you picking on this one, it makes you, makes you look crazy. Hey, listen, if you believe that controversy helps sells movies, then this movie right here is in luck because it just got one. Let me tell you the whole story. You're green. You're white. But (laughs) this is that. This is wicked, y'all. The movie, that is. And things were going fine for this movie, which has yet to be released, by the way. People were loving the trailer. Are loving the trailer. There's excitement for the film. People are already buying tickets. Things were fine. And then those goddamn fans out there had to go. The fans, once again, the fans had to go and piss somebody off. And this time, they pissed off the wrong person. They had to go and piss off the wicked witch herself right there. How did they do that? What did they do to this woman? They went out there and started making them memes and posters out there. Oh, no. Yeah, they so, took it upon themselves, huh? Yeah, they pe- yeah, people are already talking about, oh, what did they do? Did they 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 put a watermelon in their hand like they did the Black Panther boy right here? You Damn know it, they, man. Yeah. All oh, people, it's worse than that. They did much worse than that. They took a hat and pulled it down over our eyes. Oh my Are God, you kidding what me? the hell? Yeah, people, don't, what y'all are wrong for that? No, wow. so, so people, that is the controversy right here. And we're gonna talk about this and see what the opinions are of Mr. Green over here. I mean, after all, she's green, you're green, your opinion is what counts right here. And True. we'll even talk to Mr. Kumbia King over here and see what he thinks. I am not trying to influence anybody's opinion right here. I will tell you mine, and even I'm not trying to be too pushy with it, but they pulled this, they pulled this woman's hat down over her eyes, mm. and the actress who plays the Wicked Witch, or the soon-to-be Wicked Witch that we know, Cynthia Arrivo, Erivo, I think, however you say her last name, I'm sorry. Let me get that straight, because she might get mad at me. Anyway, uh, she took offense to this, because let's go ahead and take a look at the situation to see what made her so upset. So this is the original poster right here. And this is an altered poster that you see right here. Now, Mm -hmm. this was done by some fan sites out there or some uh, uh, Instagram fan uh, postings that were done for this. And she saw them and compared the two. And then she, uh, she really, she felt, she felt some kind of way. Feelings ran deep Mm. with this. She said, none of this is funny. None of this is cute. It degrades me, it degrades us. The original poster is an illustration. I am a real life human being who chose to look right down the barrel of the camera to you, the viewer, because without words, we communicate with the eyes. Our poster is an homage, not an imitation. To edit my face and hide my eyes is to erase me. And that is just deeply hurtful. And then she puts the (coughs) poster that she prefers out there right there. Let me put this right here to remind you and cleanse your palate. Um, so uh, let me just put my opinion out there and tell you how I feel about this and correct me, you know, give me more information if my opinion is not, it's not well informed or if I'm saying some kind of ignorant myself. Um, so, uh, I don't want to respect, or, or I'm sorry, I don't want to, I want to respect this woman's opinion. I do not want to disrespect her in any kind of way. And I want to respect her feelings on this situation right here. However, you know, my my initial reaction to this is that it is an overreaction. And I'll explain why that's the case. Because what I think the, the, the fans were trying to do, the fan accounts were trying to do out there when they were making these images, the, the one that you see right here. 
uh, I think what they were trying to do is they were trying to make this look more like the original poster from Broadway. They were just trying to see what it would look like, you know, if they took the real life characters and just made an homage to this right here. Uh, I don't think that they meant any kind of offense to her. I don't think they meant to hide her. I don't think they meant to actually, I don't think they meant any racism with this. Also, if you look at it, uh, just like the original poster right here, uh, Ariana Grande's face is uh, covered too, partially. So, as I said, I don't think this was intended to hurt her. Uh, I, you know, I, uh, and the reason why I'm, I'm feeling like that is because, well, first of all, it's no extreme situation like the Black Panther poster right there. Jesus. Yeah, now that's offensive. <laughs> also, they didn't try to whitewash her or try to like, you know, they're not trying to hide any features or anything. And not, nobody's complained about her playing this character. Uh, and they, now, you want to get into some racial conversations about this. That's another conversation they had. But the, the, I don't think anybody out there who's racist is having a problem with her playing this character. But that's another discussion. But they didn't do anything to it like whitewash her like they did Ariel in the, the, <laughs> the live action Little Mermaid where they took... Uh, Holly Bailey and, ma and <laughs> we say whitewash and they made her a white woman. <laughs> they, just, they, just, they, just, they just killed her ass out the picture and just put a, put a white woman in there. <laughs> like somebody came up behind her like <laughs> and then put this white girl right there, put Taylor Swift up in here. <laughs> so, like nobody would know. And that, like nobody would notice. Oh, they noticed because they said, ah, yes, that's better. But <laughs> <laughs> oh, yes. and those were straight up racist that were doing that. <laughs> you know, that those are people who, again, you know, then crown, tr crown woke, hating diversity, whatever, you know, the term is of the week that they're choosing for it. Those that was intentional. Uh, yeah, this I don't I, I again, respect to her feelings, man. I don't want to just I, 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 I want to actually entitle her to that and, you know, and, and try to understand how she's feeling, too. But my initial reaction right now is uh I just don't see it. I just don't see the why, why that she would be so hurt by this. Uh, I think I do think it's an overreaction myself. I don't know, Oz, but you like, like you're the green one. You tell me. Ah, listen, her feelings are her feelings. So let's just take that right off the table. Mm -hmm. uh, me overreacting. This is probably one of the stupidest things I've ever heard. <laughs> <laughs> Straight up and down. I was trying to tiptoe around it because I wanted. I did not nah. want to offend anybody in the room right here. But nah, please continue. That's again, huh? Her feelings are her feelings. Whatever she feels is her feelings. Again, I'm not an actor. I don't know. The, I'm looking at you and to your soul and all this. Shit. They listen. Whatever method or acting shit you're trying to do in this poster, and it, you know they're taking it away from you. Hey, I'm sorry. Whatever happened has happened. But the bigger deal is it's the internet. The internet is going to internet every time. And if you're going to put all of your energy into this, right? And when you look at this, this is hurting your soul. You need to look at that Black Panther shit again. Okay. If this is hurting your soul, yeah. what does that shit do to you? Oh, he you know what I mean? done so much worse. <laughs> it could have been crazy. The fact that they, like you said, took the image of you still, it's still you. Right. And mimic the poster so much so that they even covered up our Aria Grande's face up. To yeah. look like the poster, because again, the original, uh, the the original live action one, you see more of you know both of their faces, mm -hmm. whereas the poster, you kind of see them kind of you know uh, hardly. So, like you said, they mimic the poster just to see what it would look like, and instead of saying, "Okay, that's a you know an interesting edit," you know, no problem. I prefer the the one that we have now. If you want to, if you want to comment on the internet, which is the point anyway, why would you even do that? But if you wanted to, that's a way to kind of spin it. But you're out there feeding the trolls, you know, with this whole, oh, I'm hurt. My arts and I'm doing this and da, da, da. You're talking to, you're talking to vapor. You're talking to the air at this point. You know yeah, what I mean? You may, yeah. bring, you may make it worse for yourself by even responding to this. And again, your feelings are your feelings. I'm not taking away a few for anything. I'm the outside looking in. Again, I'm not an, I'm not an actress, actor. I don't know what meaning or thing you were trying to put behind this. But at the end of the day, it's fans, man, making fan shit. That has nothing to do with what's going on. Yeah. Here. You, 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 say, <laughs> yeah you, you say it was them, you know, you're feeding the trolls. She was not even being trolled. Somebody- and That's was, the thing. Yeah. In her mind, she was. In her mind, she was. And this person was not trolling her at all. This person no. was- 
this person probably thought that they were actually doing something pretty cool. They thought that they were doing, you know, they 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 were not trying to do anything this woman. They probably didn't even think she would see it. They yeah. were just taking this. Yeah. They were just taking this and saying, man, what would it look like? It think of it as an experiment. What would it look like if I took the live action and made it look like the poster? That's yeah, the all same, it was. The same way they took like the uh, the X-Men back in the day in the 90s and they reconfigured them and put them in the comic accurate photos and photoshopped them and put them and see what it would look like. That's an ex- that's pretty much what they did here. You know what I mean? Let's put it yeah. in the poster accurate position to see what it would look like. But kids is crazy now. I'm yeah, like, all right, man. They're so- I'm like, all right, man. It's too much. It's too much. When you, in my, in my opinion, yeah. When you, when you, when you pick on something like this, mm. you really start to take away from the bigger issues out there. Like mm. I said, this could have been so much worse. Oh, that, that there are so many other things to complain about. Possibly some things that are coming up to complain about. This is nothing. Mm-hmm. And in fact, I think that you are making a fan feel bad. Mm-hmm. That was actually trying to do something that they thought yeah. was kind of cool. I, th- yes. you know, I think you, I think what you're doing is more offensive than you being offended. If you want my yeah. honest opinion, and I'm with you, Oz. If you yeah. also want my opinion, now she gonna really get mad. Who she been come out to us? <laughs> <laughs> you <laughs> black bastards. <laughs> but, <laughs> but I actually think this poster is cooler. Yeah, because. I like it. I, one, of, one of the problems I think that we have with posters today is that posters, they prioritize, and I understand it because it's a business, but they prioritize making sure that you see the actors. They prioritize being, you know, a little too forward with things instead of doing something that is cool and moody. I think that that is kind of subtle. I think that that is moody. I think that's cool. Uh, you know, I, and I remember when, when the, more, more posters used to be done like that. Uh, that yeah. that right there. Stop getting fucking offended. That maybe that don't need to be the main poster, but that's a damn good looking teaser poster right there. Oh, you took the words right out of my mouth. If this was a teaser poster. That would have been awesome. And then the other poster could have been their full faces. Sure. Yeah. You know that would have been dope. Yeah. If that look, man, listen. Back in the day, they didn't even have to. Sometimes things were so subtle. They didn't even put a fucking title on there. When Batman came out, you didn't even oh, yeah. see Batman's face. You didn't have the word <laughs> no. Batman on there. You had the bat nope. symbol. That all was right? it. And then later on, they had you know him and all that yeah. stuff, and the and posters came out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is this is actually pretty cool. I love this poster right here. If you want, yeah. if you really want my honest opinion, and you sitting up here That's getting funny. mad by. And, and you're right, I was getting deep with this shit. This was me <laughs> looking down the barrel of your soul with this. But listen, I didn't see none of that when I looked at this poster. I looked at this poster, what the fuck you looking at? <laughs> you know I'm like, okay. And you know what? Now I got to critique this poster. I didn't mean to come in here and do this. <laughs> now I got to talk about the goddamn poster. Now I got to talk about the real poster. I think the poster, this poster is so good. Now I got to talk about this shit because... You look at this, listen, you got this poster right here and it makes you wonder what's being said. She, yes. She, she, yes. She's whispering. Yes. She looks like she's kind of got a smirk on her face. It makes yep. you wonder what's going on. Here, she just, she looked like she's confused or she's tuning her out or she sees something not paying attention to what she's saying. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's yeah, a blank it's expression. Too, you know, you talk right. about looking deep, deeper to my soul. I think it was the, the edibles just clicked in or something. You know, I don't... <laughs> I don't know, man. I mean, you want you want to complain? We'll complain. This is stupid. This is ridiculous. Yeah, it's, a, it's, a, like, it's a dumb it's, argument, man. It's a dumb yeah, argument. Yeah, yeah. You, you, they, when they always say you pick your battles, this was not a, even a <laughs> fight. <laughs> it, wasn't, yeah. it wasn't even an argument to even go up against. No. You know, some um, some fan, the internet made something. And the internet was nice to you. It's not nice <laughs> to a lot of people, but they were actually nice to you. And yeah, you yeah. got angry for that. Man, okay. Yeah, she could have been putting a goddamn uh, piece of fried chicken up to your head right now or something. <laughs> <laughs> they, put, they put a watermelon on your oh, hat. Yeah, yeah, yeah. She could have been, ass y'all could have been eating a slice of watermelon together right now. <laughs> 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 but now they decided to make you look like the fucking poster. Yeah, that's that's it. Oh, I'll show you. <laughs> <laughs> Getting deep what? in this shit. I don't even know what the hell you're talking about. <laughs> This this offends me. This degrades me. They don't they don't do none of that shit. 
It took grace. It took grace because they pulled your brim down. That's it. Oh, my Lord. Oh, my. It, yeah, it, like somebody, it's a fan poster, and it's not meant to be offensive. This fan did it out of love for this. They did it because they just wanted to see what it would look like to pay homage yeah. to something that is officially part of the property. I don't know what the f- is going on with you. Yeah. I don't know. Yeah, that poster, she's looking like a word. They talking shit to me, word. <laughs> I like that. They, this one, I don't know what she's doing, but that original poster, I like that one because she's like, word, they talking shit? Okay. <laughs> yeah, I look at this post and I and I, I see her talking about, hey, you know what I'm saying? You know, I don't, <laughs> I'm right here. I'm like, oh, what's being said right here? You know, yeah, it's, 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 it, yeah, this, 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 like I said, this, this has more mood and feeling to it, man. I don't know. Mm-hmm. I, I don't know. I don't know. You do you want to say something, man? Oh, I, I just wasn't sure if you're going to want to hear my opinion. It's yeah, a of course. Contra- if I've, I've kind of got some contrasting, but that's because I'm privy to other information that I think. Oh, okay. That's what um, I'm talking about. Oh, okay. Behind well, the scenes. <laughs> okay. I'm only privy to this information because there's a guy who like covered this like in detail. Uh, D'Angelo Wallace made a video on the subject who kind of went into the background and I was like, why? Because everybody agrees. Like it was like, this is still an overreaction. Like, but there mm-hmm. was buildup behind where it's being upset with AI edits that were not flattering. Um, I won't go into it, but I'll tell you to the show. Uh, so it kind of just seems like it was more a case of like, being angry and build and you you everybody has that where like they're getting angry and angrier at something and then the wrong person who's trying to be nice comes in and you misinterpret because you've already had so much ill will build up that you like explode on that person and it does kind of seem like that negative attitude was building up in the back of her mind so she took this as like a slight on her when it was very clearly a fan that was excited but i also can't be upset when she's like, yeah, I've been getting racist ass comments before. So I kind of just. I get it. But why take it out on the poster that is, is the probably one of the least offensive. The least about offensive. All of I think it was just the matter of like, once you have that mindset in your head, you start to see anything as an attack. And that's. I, I get it. Cause I, I think you're right. I think I can understand. Can you imagine mm. being under that, under that kind of pressure? I get it. You, you people are just. They're coming at you and you to be a, a, an actor in Hollywood and put into a big property and the, have the racist come out and attack you over and over and over again. I can understand how that could build up and make you stressed out, make you you know uh, frustrated. And but uh, but what I'm saying is. And, and to be clear, like this is a fan work that she should have seen and been like, this is in support of me. And this is like this is somebody excited for my project. I mean, OK, you know what? I'll go into, into a more understanding. But still, looking at this one, she if you yeah, should pick no, one of like, the more I, racist I, I, ones. Let me be clear: this is an overreaction, and I think most people will be like, "You are doing too much," especially yeah. to somebody who is like excited for your movie. So uh, get out of all of those. Get mad at the at the racist images. Get mad at the racist, you know, the the racist comments. Call people out to put the racist art out there. Uh, I, you know, and it could just be time. I'm not her. You know, I don't know what it's like to be her and get all these things. Maybe this was the one that she saw and she just she had been seeing so much racist stuff that maybe she's just read into this too much. But I'm here to say that I still think, and maybe understandably so, <laughs> I still think it's somewhat of an overreaction, though. Uh, oh, you no, know, for I, this one, for this, yeah. for this particular yeah, image. No, and I, I agree. Like, <clears throat> even the consensus of that video was, yeah, this was not the reaction you should have had to this project understand your plight like i'm not going to take that away from you Mm -hmm. but this is not an attack on you and i i wish like all you've done is kind of like make somebody who is really excited for your project be like what the fuck i I was i did this because i was like excited the funny thing is i don't see unless you're talking about they made her mouth bigger you know her lips bigger uh maybe gave her a broader nose or something yeah i could maybe that she saw that and that triggered her or something but i I, I don't see what the the racism is is in here. Uh, oh, yeah. Like, everybody here was like, this is very clearly an homage to that original Broadway yeah, poster. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I, yeah, I don't know. I, I, okay, let me just say, I understand. I get it. I'm not her. I'm not in a position. I'm not getting all the slings and arrows from all the hateful people out there. Yeah. So that's why I say I do not want to take away from her uh, opinion. I do not want to take away from her feelings. And you're right. You put it in perspective as saying, we're not her. We're not there. So I don't know. And that's the only takeaway where I was like, yeah, it's really easy to jump on it because it is is dumb. Let's let's be real for a second. It is dumb. 
But I also am like not going to pretend that I, I have all the facts and details of this situation. Uh, yeah. Like, because like, I think like it's cool. way too easy for everybody to like dogpile on some shit without having the facts. And that's just me. Like you can be like, no, nah, I, I don't give a shit. Get, but, to put something out there for the actual racist, though. Yeah. That's all I'm saying. You know, there's people out there. If there, are pe if there are people out there who are worse, call them out. You know, calling out one of the more milder things that exact that, that happened right here. I don't I just don't I don't get that yeah. myself. But, you know, like I said, I'm not her. I don't. I was, you know, go ahead, man. What do you think? No, I'm just saying, you know, I, I understand what you're saying, Kumbia. And yeah, that makes sense. You're getting some backlash, uh, you know, or it's just racist shit left and right. And this comes out, you know, <laughs> this comes out. And you're like, I've had enough. <laughs> All these people. <laughs> Fuck everything you stand for. Erasing me and erasing everything I do. Um, again, I can't tell you how to feel. You feel how you feel, by all means. You know, but when it comes down to what is actually offending you and what could be, you know, what up, like Corey said, put that shit out there too. Because now, optically, you know, what you're putting out there, this is what everybody is seeing is this. So now everybody has their opinion on this. Yeah. Now, if we had some sort of backstory of what's going on, I'd still say, what the are you doing? Oh, yeah, because absolutely. out of all the shit you laid out, you're going to pick this? What are you doing? Pick <laughs> yeah. that shit or that shit right there. You know what I mean? Because you picking on this one, it makes you makes you look crazy. I think what, you know, the, the a good takeaway here is that we don't fully understand somebody's situation and what they're going through, and maybe we should have some understanding. With that, we should go in with, little, with some sympathy and empathy for what they're going through. And it's also another lesson of what to what to really react to and what not. You know, that uh, it's something where, you know, uh, realize that not everybody who's doing this is out to is out to get you, even though it's in a point where you've been and, you know, you've probably been bombarded by people who have been saying a lot, a lot of hurtful things. But, you know, just uh, I, I, I think just a little before you comment, and that's the thing about the internet, before you comment, just sit back, take a breather, make sure that what you're about to say is is actually, it, it, again, what we're saying, is it an overreaction or is this something that is justified? And, you know, under, they have going with a little, it, we'll understand you, you going with a little understanding yourself. Of course, that's easier said than done, you yeah. know? I, I, and and I want to say this is, this is over, this is a, uh, overreaction to something. It's one of those things where you reach your breaking point and lash out at somebody. And when <clears> you <throat> lash out and sit back and calmly reflect on what you said, oh shit, I'm sorry, I shouldn't have said that to you because I was really angry at this. Mm -hmm. So now you gotta apologize because you went off on the wrong the thing. Yeah. It's, it's a little too. And, so, and that's yeah. kind of where we are we with are, this, yeah. I believe. If, yeah. if taking to account what you said, Kumbia, and what we're looking at, that looks like the case. I, I went off on the wrong thing. So now I'm that person's the bad guy because you went off the person that said hello to you as opposed to you should have went off on the person that said. Yeah, 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 <laughs> because, yeah that's right. You know, what I mean? you know, and that's kind of where I'm look, that's how I'm looking at it. So now you got to come back and apologize to the person that was nice to you. Yeah, yeah. So it's a, it's a it, teachable it, moment for everybody, you know? Yeah, I think so. Mm -hmm. <laughs> So this is the thing, you know, you had and I want to thank Ryan Hamilton for this, because, I mean, again, maybe this is something uh, I don't know if this is a good example or not. He just sent it to me. Maybe uh, I'm, I don't know the context of all this. Maybe there's a story I'm missing here. But, you know, she's calling out a fan poster that was that that that, that had no ill intent yeah. at yeah. all. But then you have this image here. It's a war image with this guy who's given this thousand yard stare because he's been traumatized by war. And uh, and then they they put her in that picture right there, <laughs> you know. So now, <laughs> you know, yeah. now why is she not making a big deal about this image right here? You know what I'm yeah. saying? <laughs> now, again, maybe I'm missing something. I don't claim to to, to know everything that's going on her, but. <laughs> <laughs> That's just silly at this point. What the hell? <laughs> it, it, it is. It is. <laughs> Man, you see that? That's pretty cool, right? That was actually made by one of the toasters. Oh, hey, everybody. I am so sorry. I did not see you standing there, but I'm glad you are because we do have to give a word out to our sponsor right now. I want to tell you about them Shopify. 
And that's why I was showing Pixie this little figurine of Mr. Toasty right here, because this was made by one of the Toasties in our community, James, who, as you can see, is very talented. So talented that I think he could sell these online, becoming his own entrepreneur. And you know what? If you're as talented as James is, and I know you are, you can do the same. And the best place to start doing that is, of course, you know what I'm about to say, Shopify. Why? Because Shopify is the global commerce platform that helps you sell at every stage of your business. Shopify is there from the launch of your online shop all the way to that potential millionth order. So Shopify is there to help you grow at every stage. So whether you're selling toys or t-shirts, Shopify is helping you sell everywhere. And they have great online support 24 seven. And they're there to help you sell with more ease with the power of AI with Shopify magic. Businesses that grow, they grow with Shopify and they know that you also need money to make some money. So they're here to help you save some money. And how are they doing that? You know how, because I got a code for you. If you go to shopify.com slash toasted, you'll get a $1 per month trial period with Shopify. I wanna thank Shopify for sponsoring this portion of the show. And I wanna thank all of you out there for your support. And now, back to the show. You know, it, it, I don't know. I don't know. I, I, I hope she feels better. I hope that. The, <laughs> uh, I really do. She's a. She's. I, I, I want to end this on a on a positive note for and her. What? What's I was up? just gonna be like, and I'm sorry if I came across as like putting a damper on the fun because I, I don't want to be like, oh, I gotta make everybody feel bad. About yeah, it. man. Like, you no, know, no, why don't you let us talk shit? And just let it be, you know? Come on, man. Why don't you just let it be bullies, man? I mean, God damn. <laughs> no. When it's all like, said and done, I, what you said makes sense, but I still haven't changed oh, my no, stance. Oh, no, no. Like, I absolutely all. agree that this is an overreaction, but I, yeah. I do want to, like, offer some context for, like, maybe. Oh, Jesus. More. Mother Teresa over here, man. You know how to come <laughs> in. Just... Wow. Oh, cool. Oh, cool. Be a Jesus over here. Yeah. Yeah, man. <laughs> Killjoy here, man. We were having a real good time just beating this woman up, and then he had to come up and just stop it. You know, just, why, why, you know, why were your self righteous ass? No, I'm kidding. I'm kidding, man. You know, I'm kidding. No, no. That's why I said at the beginning of it. Please give me some context yeah. to this. Please let me know if there's more to this. And you did. That's and, what I asked for. And in fairness, had I not watched that video, I probably would have been right in here dunking on it just as much. So. Well, we're not. <sighs> so I, I, I'm not any better. Is let, what I'm no, no, at. you are better. And let me say, because without no. that context, we're doing what kind of maybe what she's doing. We're doing what the Internet does. You know, we're coming in and giving these opinions. Without a full story, we're just having a reaction to what we see in the immediate time. And so that's why that's why I always say, somebody give me context to this if there's more. Yeah. No, and and for me, and again, even with that context that Kumbia gave, maybe there's more after that. But for what we saw and what old Adam just said, my opinion stays the same. Yeah. I the only thing that maybe changed with me is that I have I have some sympathy for her. Because I didn't know she was getting hit with that much stuff that when she saw something, she was so tender and hurt from seeing. Those. And I'm not saying that as a, I'm not, I'm not saying like, man, you snowflake. You know, I'm not saying that at all. <laughs> now, now you're making it worse. <laughs> no, I, mean it like that. I really mean like, when I say tender, you know, you, you kind of, you when people keep hitting you and hitting you and hitting you with these hurtful comments, you get a little raw. Yeah. It begins, you get a little sore. I mean, shit, we, we see it here. Like sometimes somebody will hit you the wrong way. And, and I'll like, blow up. You'll blow off. And I will head. blow up. I will blow the hell up. So I've done and, it. They caught me wrong. I will and, say and, that. What's that? And then what you do after, after you blow up on them, what do you do afterwards? I'm you, sorry. You, 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 <laughs> exactly. Yeah. Exactly. Y'all yeah. uh, yeah. yeah. know I'm just playing. <laughs> exactly. Yeah. Exactly. So that's what I'm saying. I think, <laughs> I think like. You got to come back and this, apologize because you hit the I'm, wrong person. Yeah. I'm going into this with more understanding, more sympathy than what I had before. Thanks to what you said. And I do understand it. I mean, it's the internet. And so she got hit so many times. It's sore. It's tender. It's raw. So she had a, she, she lashed out when she saw something at a moment where she was already frustrated. Now, having said that, I hope that she has probably learned something from this. Yeah, and like, maybe she can, you know, have some understanding herself. And that's the lesson here. Everybody has to have some understanding. Well, understand where she's from. Now she has to have some understanding that this was not a hurtful piece of art right here, I don't think. And maybe she... Maybe she can apologize. Maybe she doesn't. But I hope that she realizes that. All right. You know, sometimes it's good to sit back, take a breather and realize maybe I was slightly out of line. You know, teachable moment for everybody is what I'm thinking. I don't know. 
I don't know. <laughs> Yo. <laughs> you <laughs> you, you <laughs> sent to the <laughs> no. <laughs> <laughs> you really are the wicked witch. <laughs> Somebody said, yeah. where the hoes at? He says, y'all are wrong, it's <laughs> racist. I'm not, this is not me. No, 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 don't take this as like, well, what's racist about it? No, oh. I'm asking you. Um, again, are we missing something? What's racist about this image here? Yeah, because it's, yeah, it's what's racist I'm about aware, it? it's just yeah, it's, it's not. to that original. So. Yeah, I, I, I really want to understand. I want to yeah, understand. Not chap- not challenging at all with no, a that no. where do you see the racism in this? I'm yeah, I want to see I want to see it too. I don't see it. Hell uh, yeah. Okay, he emailed me, he said. Okay. Please. Yeah. No, no, no. Let me see. Let me see <laughs> here. Uh okay, so he said that poster that poster is is racist. He said, huh? I'm curious to hear that. He question. got my ass. He got, got, him. Got, him. <laughs> got him. Got him. Got him. What do you mean? What do you mean? Man, we we put this up on YouTube. We gotta we have to edit this out. But man, he can't. Oh, you, <laughs> you, sir, you are good. Oh, he's laughing at the chat. You are too. good. <laughs> He says this that post is racist as hell. It's because of what we missed out. It's not what you see, Oz. It's what you can't hear. I can smell your nappy pussy. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> you know what? <laughs> All right, man. All right. You, <laughs> you sir. <laughs> you, sir, are good. I'm going to kill your ass. <laughs> <laughs> now, she need to be mad. She need to be mad at that. <laughs> <laughs> Why you? She she needs to be mad at you. <laughs> exactly. God damn it! Wow. <laughs> I am so pissed at you right now because <laughs> got all three of us because you were so yeah. good. I was convinced he was like, "What the f- are we missing?" I mean, made us get all serious. Okay, well, <clears throat> no, seriously, man, let us know, please. Put us on. <laughs> no, 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 no offense. Man, you had me nervous, too. I was like, oh, shit. We'll talk about it. I was like, what the f*** could it possibly like, be? Oh, what did I miss here? Oh. I was like, yeah, you need to show me this, because I don't see shit. Uh. <laughs> he showed me all right. <laughs> oh. Oh. oh, well. Well, you made it to the end of the video. That must mean you really like what we do. So if you do, check out these other videos just like this one. Check out our other YouTube channels and subscribe to join our wonderful Toasty community. And as always, stay toasty.